guys, it's Sarah from All Coin Bus Ladies. So today we're gonna talk about one of the old coins that just, I don't wanna say came out of nowhere, but it's got a massive community. And even though they've got rivals around, they seem to be like the one to go to for their speciality. And we're gonna talk about red coin today. So I'm gonna do a quick brief of a coin review, more likely see what they've been up to, what sort of a hot news if they've been having on their Twitter, as well as we'll see how they're doing on CoinMarketCap. So let's go on to their website first. Obviously, while Bitcoin is the largest cryptocurrency in the market, it is one of the most controversial coins in the present time. With Bitcoin's price hitting a low, the crypto market plunged into a major depression. Bitcoin, which uses the proof-of-work algorithm to regulate the blockchain operations, has been rivaled by many other improved blockchain projects with more advanced algorithms such as proof-of-concept and proof-of-stake. Regulated by the advanced proof-of-stake velocity, POSV algorithm, Redcoin, is more than a social currency. Representing the next generation of blockchain technology, Redcoin caters to the old functions leading to ownership and activity. Derived from Litecoin, this renowned peer-to-peer -peer open source cryptocurrency can be integrated into all kinds of social media platforms with the motto of becoming the social currency that enriches people's social lives and makes digital currency easy for the general public. Redcoin represents the social media coin in the digital age. Operational since 2014, Redcoin has experienced a steady growth across all digital platforms from Reddit to Twitter. So what is the technology behind Redcoin? When like compared to the existing proof-of-work and proof-of-stake protocols, the proof-of-stake velocity offers more competent solutions to users, building upon the advantages attributes of proof-of-stake to mitigate the flaws in the early algorithms. Apparently, the proof-of-work and proof-of-stake algorithms come with a number of flaws, including the disconnect between the economic and social aspects of a currency. Encouraging ownership and activity, the proof-of-stake velocity algorithm leverages the advantage of the existing protocols to develop a more advanced blockchain solution for social media applications. So one of the features that Redcoin offers is the online tipping currency. It's developed with the aim of bringing the cryptocurrency closer to social media and the masses. We know what sort of influence social media have on the possible success of a coin. And Redcoin was not built to draw wealth from various sources, but rather to serve as a necessary tipping currency. Redcoin followers have the opportunity to use the currency for tipping campaigns on Twitter, targeting followers with backgrounds in cryptocurrencies. Similarly, Reddit users can tip Redcoin in appreciation of interesting posts and comments on the Redcoin community. Besides, the Redcoin followers can tip red coins on Twitter, appreciating relevant posts. There is also Redcoin Broadcast, and it's an attempt to make a foray into the mainstream social media. The Redcoin executives introduced the Redcoin Broadcast feature in April 2014, serving as a thunderclap-like platform. Redcoin Broadcast is a powerful medium for sending messages across existing social media channels, including Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr. As for the Redcoin community members, they can deploy broadcasts free of charge to expand their reach, soliciting support for their project from influencers. An additional feature that I want to mention is Social X, which is going since 2014. Social X operates as a multifaceted project which strives to bring Redcoin closer to the mainstream media. By all means, Social works towards making tipping easier while eliminating any third party intervention. So now let's go and check out some recent developments of theirs. I really like the website as well. Redcoin's got a great, easy to access and easy to work around website where everything I've mentioned previously is on, you can find it on the news and there are different categories and it explains it all in more details. So it's evident from the current trends in the market it's been a busy year for all coins so far, prompting investors to shift their attention from the big market movers to the lesser known projects. And among the top performing all coins of 2018, Redcon has done quite an impressive job as you can see launching existing features, and payment processes for the community. Popular as a social cryptocurrency, this promising blockchain networks attempts to keep their audience in the loop by launching effective campaigns. Known for its efforts in establishing a great user experience, the Redcoin team has introduced some exciting developments recently. Looking at the developments of the past few months, 
There have been some interesting upgrades to the blockchain, which includes listings and partnerships. And as per the latest updates, Redcon has been recently added to some additional exchanges, as well as on their Twitter, which I think is very important to follow your projects on social media, because how else are you actually going to know what's going on with them? They have this massive announcement of four, which is a quite an achievement, which will unlock further possibilities like Lightning Network, Atomic Swap, and it's obviously at the top of their website, which I kindly left for the last, best for the last. So I highly recommend you guys actually do it yourself as a homework if you're interested in Redcon or currently invested. Let me know in the comments actually, have you heard of Redcon? Do you stake it? Do you huddle any? Are you planning on it? And that'll be your homework. And let me know what you think of this possible partnership. There has also been an announcement of LendaCoin collaboration, which will allow you to stake Redcoin on your mobile device and earn staking rewards. So Redcoin is currently trading at not not four cents and is up two percent in twenty four hours. It's got market cap of one hundred thirty nine million and is ranked seventy five on Coin Market Cap. It's also high was around January, like most of the altcoins, and it was almost three cents. So currently, yeah, it's quite down, but we know every altcoin took a massive beating of this massive market crash. So you can get Redcoin quite easily. You've got it on Cryptopia, Blue Trade, Your Bit, Live Bit, Trade Satoshi. Usually get it with Ethereum, Bitcoin. I can see you can get it with some Fiat on Light Bit. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I know there is some competitors to Redcoin, smaller ones, smaller players, but doesn't mean that they're any worse. Uh, if you guys know anyone, recommend it. I'll gladly check them out. Let me know what you think of Redcoin would like me to review next. And remember to subscribe to our channel, Alcoin Best Ladies, if you haven't yet. Follow us on Twitter. And if you like me, my style, follow me at Twitter at CryptoSara. And I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.